The dashboard isn't just limited to add-on software. It's also a standalone utility that can be used in numerous ways to gather and report on your data. Here's an example that demonstrates the various chart types displaying browser stats for the last few years. In addition to running the dashboard in its own window, the utility offers enough flexibility that you can embed a dashboard, a dashboard category, or a dashboard widget into a new or existing BBJ program. The syntax is easy, and you can embed a dashboard object that you create from scratch, or even one from an existing dashboard program via a called interface. Here's an example of a BBX program that embeds an entire dashboard into the app. The top part of the app allows you to select a dashboard to embed and a color theme to apply to the widgets. The dashboard comes with over 80 color themes, so you can select one of the existing themes or easily create your own. When I select a color theme, the program sets the colors for each widget and calls a refresh method. This gives you a basic idea of how your app can interact with an embedded dashboard object. The dashboard is also highly customizable via CSS, with dozens of components defined with selectors that you can control. By modifying some of the CSS and changing the colors when building the charts, we can dramatically affect the presentation of the dashboard. Finally, the dashboard is flexible enough to report on just about anything. Here's an example where we've exported some of our Google Analytics data to comma-separated value files. We can then create line charts, pine charts, and grids that import and display the data. This is done via the Basis Database's built-in stored procedure, which imports the comma-separated value file data in a single SQL statement, allowing you to easily select columns to view, filter data, and even control the grouping and sorting of your data. That's a quick look at the dashboard utility and what it's capable of.